Hello and welcome to our first playthrough of Dark Souls 3. Now I know what you're thinking, Liam, if you've seen if you've seen my playthrough of Dark Souls 3 at the moment, that is it's not happening anymore. Um, I figured out that I was a little bit unhappy with my Pyromancer character and where I was in the game and how I was progressing. So I'm starting a brand new playthrough with Paul. Um, we've chosen the Warrior class and we are what we're gonna do is we're gonna um, we're gonna make uh, we're gonna make this more of a time to time thing because we're gonna um, when Paul's around I'm gonna play it with him and then I'm gonna go away. oh shit need to figure out the controls again it's been a while it's been a while and um, yeah so when's Paul around I'm gonna play it with him but when he goes away I'm gonna carry on I'm gonna grind uh, and when he comes back we'll be at a different place in the game Jesus I am terrible at this. I've completely forgotten all the controls, Paul. Uh, right, okay. So, <laughs> L1 is to block oh, your shields. Oh, I hate the axe. Which you need to... Uh, why do you hate the axe? It's slower. It's slower, yeah. It's more just, powerful, though. Oh, uh, yeah, but you know, more stamina being used up. Great. Ash and flask. Right, I'm going to remember... Yeah, always, just, as soon as you something. lock on, put that shield What up. is the potion button? Uh, square. <laughs> square. Okay, I was about to push that. And that is... Okay, switching that. It's that. All right, I think yeah. I've got... That. Basically, always have your shield up at all times. Yeah. Yeah, and then... No, I don't want to use a potion, I just said! Don't press square! No! We're off to a, a fantastic start. I've only got as far as the, uh, the undead settlement, and I was about to fight the tree boss, but I kind of... I kind of stopped. I lost a bit of interest, because... The area I found at the time was like really difficult. Yeah, and the tree boss, to be fair. Yeah, I and hated uh, that if boss. I had a if I had a tough time in that area, then God knows what uh, how I'd find that tree boss. You've got an ash and flask back anyway, and it's a flask. Oh, back, so how how does that happen? Oh, some enemies give you a brand a random enemy and might give you an an Essence flask. Do you know what? I saw that in the game when I was yeah. wondering, like when I was on my old playthrough, and I was Dark Souls Two didn't do that. Really? Yeah. It's, I was really glad it's being that being a bit did it. nice. Yeah. Right. So I'm not going to fight the crystal lizard just yet. I'll get. I think I'm going to get a little bit slaughtered. What I'm going to do is. Why well, you get slaughtered the crystal lizard? Because he's a little bit hard. Oh, it's the actual big one, isn't it? Yeah. As, yeah. If you go to the right yeah. over here. Yeah, it's the big you one. You go up yeah. here and you get a good item. Yeah. But for now, I'm going to uh, just fight this. Make my way over to the first boss and yeah. see how I get on there. So yeah. Uh. No, I don't know why I stopped playing this, to be honest with you. Because uh, I think it's because it's like such a, a big game and it's quite a hard, daunting game as well. And there was a lot of things on my plate as well at the same time as this. Yeah. Like I had to play Ratchet and Clank in order to get a review out for that. And then I'm doing Doom, which I've nearly nearly completed that game now. So I'm very happy. I will do. I'm only a couple Love of chapters. Yeah, I'm only a couple of chapters away from doing it. Oh, missed. Oh, you need. Do you want to? Um, I need to get that. You need to. Do you want to reset the controller so you can press circle to jump? Because remember, oh, it's, yeah. it's defaulted onto okay. L3, isn't it? Uh, yeah, I'll tell you what. Uh, why don't I do that? Uh, how do you do that? Sorry? Right, go to the Optist. Yeah, the system, system. And then. Go down to jump controls and put it on circle, and then make it much easier. I didn't even know that. Yeah. Thank you. I, I can, can't use L3 to jump. See? Oh, sh hello. Boom. I mean, it also as well, another skill to learn. Yeah. I'm not going to try and put too much on you. No, please, but no. But parrying. Um, if you... Is that what I was doing at the beginning, like that? Yes. Or... If you time that right, you can, then again, Is it like put a... a hard attack on someone. Is like, it a... like a Bloodborne situation with the shotgun? Yeah, it sort of staggers it, yeah. I tried parrying and I'm... It's hard to... I'm not going to... And your shield probably isn't the best to do it with. No. But it is I'll a good one to practice I'll with. tell you what, I'll... Uh... I'll leave parrying for now. Yeah. But, uh, um, but it's a handy skill to pick up because yeah. then you can do a backstab, but obviously it's from the front. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm sure uh, Katy Perry would know a thing about parrying. Katy parrying. <laughs> oh, great. I had to. I'm sorry. I had to. There you go, that guy. You're dead. You're dead. dead. What's down? I think... I have found oh, as well some of the. Uh, well. AI, I'm not going to try and diss the game too much, but I think sometimes the AI can be a bit. I take advantage of the AI stupidity sometimes. Yeah, game. I mean it's not the best AI in the world. I can no. I can agree with you on that, but 
you, you know, especially how they stare at walls and stuff yeah. like that. But it is like enemy placement like that. But once you get hit by an enemy, that's when it fucks you up. So I you're going straight to the boss, aren't you? Yeah, I'm at half health though, so uh, I tell you what, I'm just going to wing it. I'm going to die yeah. the first time, so I I know. Fingers crossed, though. Let's have a look. Sword. Brilliant. All right, now attack. Just yeah, attack now. Yeah, because you can get yeah. his health down just like that. Yeah, it still damages him. Oh, hello. Let me out. All right, I'm gonna get out the way just to heal. Yeah. Right now, no, what does shield I do? up? Stay close. Yeah, shield up and stay close. Because the shield you Every, stand Everything feels like, really. a bit slow with the. Uh, I don't know whether it's because of I'm I'm not used to having an axe. Yeah. I never had an axe type weapon in a uh, in Bloodborne. And but I'm, heal. Yeah. Heal. I think you can do it first time. I think you can. I've got one Estus flask left. I'm not gonna do it. Oh, quick attack! 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 Yeah. Right now you got the ball. Watch okay. out for your stamina. Yeah. Keep your shield up, watch out for that stamina. Right, now go in, attack a few times. Couple of hits. Come on. Couple of hits. He's hitting me though. Uh, <laughs> heal. Yeah, heal. It's right, okay. shield up. Just, yeah, you can you can do this, mate, you can do it. You got it, you got it, you got it. Yes, nice oh, one. Yeah. All right, I'm already feeling good about yeah. this. Like, cause if anybody saw the first playthrough of this with the Pyramon, <laughs> it took me like 10 times to do yeah. that. And uh, no, this is this is exactly what I want. This is exactly what I want from this playthrough. I mean, through. you can change your axe soon. You'll be able to get more of weapons. Course I, yeah. Of course yeah. I can. And then I can get a sword and I can be better at this. I prefer the axe because I prefer hitting heavy. I hit a couple of times, get myself out, recover yeah. my stamina, hit in again. Yeah. Um, but I can see why people don't like it because obviously how heavy it is and how slower it can be. Yeah. No, it's fine. It's all about preference at the end yeah. of the day, really. Like, I remember in Bloodborne that you had, like, different weapons to me, even down to the, uh... You, did you have the blunderbuss or the pistol? I think I had the pistol. Yeah. yeah. See, I always stuck to my blunderbuss. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, uh, and I had the big axe, which... But I didn't really use the gun. I used to have my axe in two hands. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, see, I'd never do that with my, uh... Yeah. Well, it depends on who I'm fighting and all that, because it does require you sometimes to... Uh, have it like that in, in certain with certain enemies and stuff like that it is better to take them from a distance. Yeah, and give you that extra reach. But yeah, and I found that with that axe on double-handed axe on Bloodborne that a lot of the bosses you could knock back when you done the charge up swing. Yeah. So it gave me a bit more breathing room to heal and stuff. But as I said, everyone has different play for different exactly. Play yeah, um, and I'm I, I, I'm thankful that Dark Souls even lets you. Uh, have your own little playset and stuff like yeah. that. If you can't tell, we are massive uh, Bloodborne uh, Dark Souls fans. Yeah. Really, I I never thought I'd known about this these games for such such a long time, and it never really interested me. But I played it once, uh, and I think it was around my ex's house. Like a Bloodborne was it? No, this is I was playing. No, this is even before I started Bloodborne. Oh, right. <gasps> oh. <laughs> <laughs> I saw it happen. Like I was like rolling out back, and I was like, "Oh great, now I'm gonna die." But I'd rather die like that you than the boss. the boss. Though. I killed the yeah. I killed the dog as well. He came after yeah, me. He did. No, but um, I was around my ex's house, and this is before I started playing Bloodborne. It was out, and I remember like loads of people raving about yeah. it and stuff. And I was like, mm, "Not too sure." And my sister, sorry, not my sister, my girlfriend's brother at the time, a uh, really nice guy. Uh, he was playing Dark Souls 2 on his PC. Yeah. And he was like, oh, come here, Liam. He was, you, know, you know you like this, it'll be good. And I was like, okay. I sat down for like 10 minutes and all that and started playing it. And I it was, I found it really cool. I really liked it, especially like the, I don't know, the atmosphere, the environment, and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah, go get your souls back. Which, Not oh, that way. I think it was oh, I want to kill these enemies, enemies oh, okay. first. But yeah, I, I know I know what the dog is, it's fine. But um, yeah, and about 10 minutes in, you know, the girlfriend's like, well, my ex started to get a bit um, hiffy, huffy about it, be like, uh, you know, I think that's enough now, Liam. And I'm like, Sh oh. shut up. <laughs> Liam's ex. Liam's yeah, ex. 
God. Um, oh, okay. See, yeah. obviously you introduced me to the bubble, and I didn't really think I'd like it as much as I did either, because yeah, um, it, I t- it's one of I those... had the difficulty, and I was like, am I really going to like it? But uh, it's really rewarding. To, to this day, yeah. I don't even know why I introduced you to that game. Oh. That's what. He's like, I don't want you to lose your souls. What are you doing? I'm what trying are you, to. What are you going to suicide? No, I was <laughs> trying to get uh, see if he had an item, and I was oh, trying okay. to take the item off him. But before oh, there he died, there they are. They were green. Yeah, I honestly, I don't know why I introduced you to Bloodborne in the first place. It was a. Uh... I can't. No, I can't. It was a. Uh... I think I was really into it at the time. Yeah. I, I wanted somebody to. Uh... Like it too. Like it too. Have yeah. To talk to you about it. Yeah. Yeah, and like play with. Which is why I want you to play this because I'm. Um... This, I was so far ahead. You're, you are really far ahead. I want your reaction to some <laughs> yeah. of the bosses and some yeah, of the Yeah, no, uh, I feel like this is the this is perfect thing to do. Yeah. Um, we can carry on with it like, like this and all that. But again, like I've was, like I was said to the people, I will grind on my own and I will get a little bit further. But when I feel like I've reached a point where it's quite important, like a boss or something like that, I'll put the controller down and I'll wait for you to come around. And, yeah. I'll, and we'll do it together like that. Sounds fair? That sounds fair. Yeah, okay. Right, I know this is... Samurai guy around here, and he gives good. Oh yeah, but you want? I'd want to go to the bomb. Yeah, I'd, I'd want to. I killed uh, everybody. Yeah, I killed everybody. Oh no, then. <gasps> you made me think you were dead. <laughs> cool. Right. Um, yeah. Let's I'll, go to the fire. Lane. I level up. Yeah. Yes. Good idea. Spend your souls. That S- guy, samurai guy, is quite hard, but um, he is really hard. He was yeah. one of the first people that I used the enemy AI against him. Um, yeah. I didn't actually kill him. I made him use his attack to knock himself off the cliff. Wow. <laughs> but did you get his... Uh... Yeah, you still get his armour and everything. That's cool. Yeah. Um, Level up. I'll try and talk you through it when, when it happens. Right. Of how Tell you what, I'm going to pause it now and I'm going to quickly run upstairs and get my guide... Oh, yeah, okay. I have I bought I bought the collector's edition of this game if anybody doesn't know, and I bought like, the guide with it and everything like that. And it's got a sweet red knight statue. Uh, without me bragging, no, I've actually got a guide upstairs, and I want to see what is best for this character build. So I'm gonna pause it. I'll be right back in a second. <sighs> hey, we um, so we spent like ages, we spent a little while flicking through the book, and we ended up you know a, you know going to Google instead. <laughs> because I spent twenty pounds on a book and Google was a bit more effective, so yeah, just gonna level up one on the, uh, one on, on the highlighted, whatever. There we go, four levels up, there easy peasy. At least, bam. All right. Pretty hot. She's she's pretty hot. She is pretty hot. Uh, not gonna lie. There's even a hotter person over there. What, the, the blacksmith? No, to the right. <laughs> oh, dearie. Ashen one. Oh, oh, blah, 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 blah. I know you're a merchant, just... I don't need anything from her, do I? No, I... Not from him either down there. No, you can't really do much. We are good, then. Yeah. Uh, some... Are you gonna... He gives me something. I know he does. Oh. Yeah. Oh, clap some more. There we go. Perfect. Um, are you going to kill that guy, are you? The guy who was on about the samurai guy. Oh, shit. Yeah, you're right. Thanks for reminding me. So much has happened between then and now, so I'm going to go kill the samurai guy. Well, yeah, so the way I did it, well, obviously, it's not. Um, Is this the right way? It's a cheating way, as such. I mean, I didn't actually use any cheats, but I didn't actually kill the guy. Uh, yeah, yeah if you can Carry get on. him to attack you by the edge of the cliff of where he stands and roll yeah. out the way, you've got to time it quite obviously time it well he will do an attack and he'll pretty much and he'll just like, commit suicide off the edge himself oh shit um, All right. I'll see what I can do yeah but it didn't I, could, I didn't do it the first time, I will say it did take me a couple of times to do it um, that's, that's after trying to kill him with my by myself, and I was like, "Where is he? Up there, right at the top." Oh, I see him. Yeah. He will start. So I was gonna say, he "Might even do it like then." He looked like he was gonna fall through. Right. Because that's not that's why I don't want that. I think I want to just heal. Quick. Yeah. There you go. See if you can get off the edge now. No, no, no! Ah, oh, that's oh. not what I wanted. Oh, come on! 
That's exactly not what I wanted. Oh, I thought he was going to commit suicide then. I don't know. Yeah, well, I didn't lose many souls. No, so okay. day 300 is not even a level. Um, yeah, sure. You're going to keep trying them, though? I think you should. Because... I'm going to keep trying because it's. Uh, I know it's. Uh, you get good stuff off of it, yeah. so yeah. it's fine. Uh, also, can you... Can you... Uh, do you... Can I like the bonfire in Finding Shrine, by the way. Oh, shit. Yeah. I think I already did that. I'm not too oh. sure. You mustn't have, though. No. I oh, know I didn't. I didn't, yeah. like, s slam it in, but... So oh, yeah, you've got to put uh, the sword in, haven't you? Yeah. I'm going to leave all these guys. It's fine. Yeah. Screw them. Screw them. Um, what was it? They live about? another Someone? day. Ooh. Something? Nah. Um, so my Estus flasks are my Ashen flasks. Oh, yeah. Can I go to the uh, the Blacksmith now? And get rid of that uh, that ashes flask, ashen flask. Oh yeah, I forgot you picked one. I've that, Yeah, that's yeah. that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. Yeah. So, slam my thing in the thing. No. Talk to her. Oh yeah. There you go. Uh, there you Boom. Go. There we go. Stick my sword in there. Oh yeah, there's another thing I've been meaning to talk to you about. So, yeah. you know you can upgrade your bonfires? Yes. What's that all about? Right, that makes areas more difficult. Okay. But that is also the way that I was talking about with the upgrade in your Estus Flask. Yeah. Every time you burn an undead bone shard, your Estus Flask goes like a plus one, plus two. Okay. Uh, but it does make an area more difficult. So why would you want to upgrade it if you make it a bit you more You can difficult? upgrade it. Is it just to... Uh... No, you can upgrade it at this filing shrine. Okay, and nowhere else. You can make, you can do other places if you want to make that area difficult. But I used all mine in this area because obviously I don't, I don't want to make anything too difficult yet. Yeah. In case I did the new game plus, mm. and I didn't want to visit because it carries over. Yeah. If you make anything difficult now, it carries over. There but, we go. but you want you might want to make it more difficult because the more difficult it is the more souls you get from the enemies and stuff. Yeah. Okay. Here are my souls. Yeah, you're gonna pick them up. Down straight. Um. Away. Green light. I think you can kill this guy. I really do. Yeah. Remember to use your shield. Yeah, I, that's why I was. <laughs> I mean, I, I know he it's not the best shield. He can still hurt you, but it will block some attacks. Get out of my face. Oh, yeah, but you need to remember the shield does use stamina. Okay. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Fucker. No! Son of a fucking dick. Backstab him if you can. Oh. I haven't figured out how to do that yet. Oh, wait. Oh, 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 okay. There we go. Get but roll behind him if you can, and then basically I'm nearly dead. I am dead. <laughs> oh, it's all right. Yeah. Um, I'm closer. I'm closer. If you can roll behind him, you can backstab some enemy. You can backstab yeah. enemies. It's sort of like the equivalent of um, the visceral attack. Yeah. In so Battle. what? Roll behind them, then what? Parry. Uh, and then use the, the R1. Okay. And and then it'll just. All right. Be like a heavy attack, basically. Why am I back here? You did put it in there. Like, I oh, well, swear so you I do did. It. I tell you what, next time we're going to go back to that samurai guy over the beach. Yeah.